Ted, back to the voicemail of Truth and Reason. This one about the whole Deshaun Watson situation. Hey, how's it going? Uh, big Brown fan. Uh, I have a two-part question. Do you think the Texans will be held responsible for their involvement when it comes to the, the Deshaun Watson case? Also, I see that Cam Newton is still available. Do you think he'll be a great addition to the team? Thank you. As always, appreciate all the voice emails. Now, what uh, the caller is referencing is um, apparently the Texans helped set up some of the massage therapist sessions and then provided an NDA for some of them. Um, and again, the, that can be explained away a, a number of different ways. Uh, Hayden, I can't see the league not knowing um, what went on with the Texans. I would be very surprised. So I don't think they're going to be held responsible. And I. Uh, I'll defer to you here in a minute. I think I think the tank's pretty empty with Cam Newton. Really good for a while, but the last couple of years just hadn't been there. Yeah, in terms of Texans, I mean, what can you do now? You already the draft pick already happened already. You had, you know, um, it's just hard to put it all back in the bottle at this point. So the Texans kind of maybe they knew all this, and the Browns again didn't care or just they got fleeced. I don't know. Whatever. The point being is that, no, I don't think that the Texans will will face a ton. Maybe they'll get fined or something, whatever. Um, but, yeah, I, I wouldn't figure that much to happen there. Maybe they'll be held – maybe they'll lose a draft pick or two. I don't know. But with um, with Cam Newton, I love Cam Newton. Always have. Always have loved Cam Newton. Um, I just think with this particular group, he'd probably be more of a distraction than anything. He comes in and, you know, he's got a – I love the guy. Trust me, I do. I, I love him. But he he – He's got a big personality. He's kind of, you know, not not afraid to say what he needs to say, and that's fine. But you already got all these other distractions. Do you really need another one? Um, I love Cam on the field. I love what he brings. Um, if they didn't have Jacoby Brissett, I would definitely think about it. I think Jacoby's a good quarterback for what they need. Just a guy to kind of wrangle it all in, to not be a distraction, be a good teammate, just to just, just be solid. So I think I like Jacoby in that regard. Um, and, uh, yeah, I think we're, we're going to see, uh, if, if he does play, I think we're going to see him uh, succeed.